British Army veteran viciously mugged by Tai Ji Yang at start of Dream Holiday. Mick Laverty was robbed at gunpoint by two men on Fuket Island on the first full day of the couple's Dream Holiday. Mr. Laverty and his wife Denise, from Newton Acliffe in Durham, had booked the vacation to celebrate his 50th birthday. But disaster struck when Mrs. Laverty went into a bar to use the toilet while her husband waited for her outside. When she returned she could not find her husband and frantically searched the area before returning to her hotel. Eventually the hotel was contacted by a local hospital and told that one of their guests had been admitted. Mrs. Laverty dashed to the hospital to discover her husband had been savagely beaten by the thugs and needed emergency surgery on his leg. When Mr. Laverty told the attackers he had no money, they took his watch and keys before leaving him in a side street with multiple leg fractures which have since been operated on. His wife has reported the attack to police and the couple expect to speak to the British Embassy today, according to the Northern Echo. Mrs. Laverty was initially too scared to return to the hotel fearful the robbers had the room key. And Mr. and Mrs. Laverty, who have two sons, have already had to pay about £3,000 for hospital treatment, but are worried about spiraling costs while their insurers investigate. Online fundraisers have raised almost £1,000 in the first 24 hours after a campaign called Get Mick and Denise Home was set up by an old school friend of Mrs. Laverty's. Mrs. Laverty said support from home is helping the couple get through the ordeal. Writing on Facebook she said, This has been the worst experience in my life ever I am truly gutted and devastated as to what has happened and appreciate what everybody has done for me and Mick. I just so can't wait to be back in the UK and get this horrific ordeal put behind us.